the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And now things get really exciting on the UEFA Champions League front. We're at the semi-final stage, and what we have coming up is the first leg. How do you see the match going, Stuart? Well, Derek, it could be cagey and it could be tight, but we've got some of the best players on view here, and they'll want to show just how good they really are. I can't wait for this tie to start. This is how it looks for the home side. Alex Moret is the goalkeeper. Giovanni Di Lorenzo oh, plays. Oh, big shots here, Derek. Well, it's a wild attempt. He needed something better. Offside, however. Well, you're right. He didn't know it was going to be offside, and that was a shocking miss. De Jong and Christensen Frankie De Jong Joao Felix well he made that interception look routine in truth it wasn't Oriol Romeu. Lewandowski. Now well, the pass not finding its target. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Onto Lobotka. Zielinski. Ozim Hen. Gundogan Well standing off them here Aren't they being too passive It's with Gundogan Oriol Romeu He's in with a chance And a goal The opening statement of this semi-final How important could that prove to be? Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Zielinski Gundogan De Jong Now Lewandowski carries the ball forward but can he produce from this position? Could cross it in here. Lastly, time tackle. On Gisa. Andre Frank Zombo on Gisa. Now with De Jong. And a tidy challenge. Decent looking pass. Oriol Romeu. And that'll be offside. Good run, very much in control of the situation. Zielinski.
Well, the referee trying to play advantage there, but it wasn't forthcoming. Joao Felix. On to De Jong. Rafinha. Let's fly here. Can they cover up? Well, it just petered out. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. And the second half underway with Barcelona looking to build upon what was a largely positive first half showing. André Franck Zombo Onguisa. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Onguisa. And Politano with it. We're getting the ball forward. Really good build up, but no end product. Joao Cancelo. Lewandowski now. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Matero Politano. Frankie de Jong and credit due a good intervention Giovanni Di Lorenzo a run to Rome on the wing and it's played into the centre not too fussy in clearing his lines Joao Cancelo. It's with Gundogan. Joao Felix. Now with De Jong. Lewandowski. Ongisa. Now Mario Rui. Andre Franck Zombo Ongisa. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Another perfect position to read it. Joao Felix. What a brilliant pass. And the cross smuggled away. certainly wasn't a clean tackle and the referee has got to book him I think and a yellow card it's going to be Stewart yeah the ref got that right it's a yellow card all day long well they are committed to making the substitution here Frankie de Jong. Ten minutes left for play. And he read it well, intercepting it. Well, I'm not sure they deserve anything from this game, but there's still time to find that equaliser. And you have to say the crowd have been brilliant. They're still driving the team on. Well, late in the game here, they know what they need, and that's an equaliser. Joao Felix.
He has teammates around him. Takes aim! Well, it looked as though it had a chance of going in. Well, he should make the keeper work there, but you sense a goal is coming. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. There goes the final whistle, and Barcelona with the advantage going into the second leg. Well, they'll be pleased with that victory, but it's a slender lead they're taking into the second leg, and I think they'll be confident, but it's going to be tight, that's for sure.